Hey everybody, it's time for a brand new video. Check it out. Alright everybody, here it is. This is what we're going to do today. This is Armor's Potted Meat. This is 39 cents and it is approximately a three ounce container. And it has a quick snap top on it here. So we got a bowl. We got some crackers. We got some uh, clove crackers. And we have some saltine crackers. And I also have some just generic brand salad dressing. And I got some generic mustard. And then we have a fork and a knife and a bowl. So we're going to go ahead and open this up. not too bad. This is chicken and pork. Doesn't really look the greatest and appetizing type of stuff here, but needless to say, we're going to dump it in this bowl here. Make sure to get all of it out. Cause there ain't a whole lot in here. We'll take our knife and we'll get the rest of it out. Okay, so now the can's empty. I'm going to take, I'll show you what it looks like here now that it's in the bowl. That's what it looks like in the bowl. Not too appetizing looking, but either way. So you're going to add a little bit of salad dressing. You don't want to put too much in. So that's how much I've added. Not very much. Then we get a mustard and add about two or three drops. Okay. So there it is, everybody. And yeah, we're gonna go ahead and mix that up. And the reason we add that is just kind of a filler and it adds flavor and it adds uh, a little bit more texture. And you'll see it'll look a lot better once it's blended. It almost looks like pink slime, but it's actually pretty good. Crackers. I like club crackers, you guys. They're really good. These haven't even been opened, I don't think. No, nope, they haven't. So we'll go ahead and tear them open. This is a quite simple treat to enjoy. These are some weird shaped crackers. See that everybody? So you do you take some here and you put it on the cracker. See? I'm gonna go ahead and try that and see what I think. Not too bad. There's your nutritional information, everybody. The ingredients, quite a long list of ingredients, but this is Armour's potted meat. A lot of people don't like potted meat. We've had it since I was just a little kid. My mom used to make it quite often. And I always liked it. Go ahead and put some on a saltine cracker here. See that? It smells not too bad. Mmm. 
I actually like it better on a club cracker, you guys. I did a little club crackers here. We'll turn our camera a little bit so you guys can see me. take very much, just a little bit off your knife. That's really good. So, uh, so yeah. Anyways, let get another club cracker out here, you guys, so you can see this in my perspective. The little three-ounce can goes quite a ways. See that now? And you don't have to put a lot on there. It's just fine the way it is. The Miracle Whip and the uh, mustard gives it just the right zing just the right flavor and helps it to spread out a little bit so you get just a little bit more for what you got but it ain't a whole lot in there but for a couple people to sit and enjoy it you can get it easily six seven eight crackers a piece with some on it and i'm noticing now the after zing from the everything on it. You now you just take your knife and go in there and just put just ever so slightly. That's really good. That's a perfect little filler between meals. A lot of people don't like potted meat, and uh, for the longest time I didn't eat it. But for 39 cents, I mean, it's a nice little filler. I mean, if you don't have a lot of money and you just have a couple simple ingredients around the house, like this stuff here, you can just do a quick, easy blend and then you have something nice to eat. It'll tide you over till you make a meal. It is a little bit greasy. But nonetheless, it's pretty good. Today's Rachel's birthday. Good stuff. So I'm going to be making her a good meal today for her birthday. Something hopefully she'll enjoy. There it is, everybody. I would rate this a 1 to 5 scale. I would have to give this probably about a four. Good stuff. Be sure to check out our playlist for more videos like this. Uh, we have quite a few different cooking videos and product review videos where I add my own spin on it and uh, let you know what it right. what I think about it and how it tastes and all that good stuff. Okay. So. Do you want to talk to him? Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and All thanks right. for watching, everybody. Catch you later.